Johannes Blaskowitz was a career officer who commanded the German 8th Army during the invasion of Poland. It was he who was given the task of attacking Warsaw and he took the surrender of the Polish capital on the 20th of September 1939. On the 26th of October 1939, he became Commander-in-Chief East and thus head of the German occupying army in Poland. Over the course of the next few months, Blaskowitz protested several times against Nazi crimes. He argued not only on the grounds of morality, but also on concerns about discipline and other pragmatic considerations. On the 27th of November 1939, he wrote to the commander in chief of the army, Walter von Brautisch, and complained that the police were not only spreading terror in the population incited by bloodlust. The current state of affairs is moving towards a development that will cause a source of military unrest and make it impossible to exploit the country for the benefit of the troops and the military economy. The security and tranquility of the country cannot be restored with violent measures alone. It's in the interest of both the Wehrmacht and civil administration if a tolerable order prevails in Poland. Blaskowitz sent another report to von Brautisch on the 8th of December 1939. Lieutenant Colonel Helmut Grosskurt presented this report a few days later to senior army officers on the Western Front, including Erwin von Witzleben and Gerd von Rundstedt. In a further mef- memorandum of 6th February 1940, Blaskowitz wrote, The danger has thus become apparent and it compels us to adopt a position on the question of the treatment of the Polish people. It's absurd to slaughter a few thousand Jews and Poles, for in view of the mass population, this would neither kill the Polish idea of the state nor eliminate the Jews. On the contrary, it is the slaughter which is doing the most damage. And he made further complaint on the 15th of February 1940. In reality, in reaction to Blaskowitz's memorandum of November 1939, Hitler reportedly dismissed the complaints as childish and pointed out that no war could be won with the methods of a Salvation Army. Blaskowitz's further uh, reports were not forwarded by uh, von Brautisch to Hitler. Now, I've done a much longer video which uh, explains the career of Johannes Blaskowitz, what happened before the war, what happened during the war, and his post-war fate. And if you are interested to uh, know more about this, then please subscribe. Johannes Blaskowitz was one of very few uh, German officers that openly complained about what was actually happening in the occupied territories. Thanks for listening.